Hey everyone, thanks for joining. Today I'm talking about the Flipper Zero and GPIO pins. In particular, we're going to look at uh, input uh, polling on the pins. Um, so I have a tutorial over on my GitHub in the Flipper Zero tutorials. I'll also put a link down below to that. Um, and so I've already installed that uh, tutorial on here. I can go ahead and do another demo of how to do that, um, but the directions are in there. And basically, we're going to go in. Once it's installed, it should show up under Applications, under Miscellaneous, and then under GPIO Polling Demo. Um, and so what happens is it writes hello, and it's, it's polling this pin A4, um, which is currently doing a pull-up uh, to 3.3 volts internally. And then there's a counter that increments and then it prints even or odd depending on what the value of the counter is and now we're going to go ahead and put a resistor this is a little 1k resistor um, and we put that in between those pins and now it says world so it's hello and then world um, we could just put a jumper wire here um, but just in case we're not doing input and we're doing output we probably don't want to connect ground to pin A4 um, if we're outputting 3.3 volts because uh, then you're, you're going to exceed the current limitations. Um, and then a short click of the back button um, exits the app. So um, I have over on the GitHub, it talks about kind of how you can install this yourself. Um, you're going to have to build firmware, but then when you're done, you can actually just extract the FAP file and copy it over. Um, and then I have a uh, direction on how it actually works. And I kind of walk through the application FAM file, the GPI polling demo, and then the, uh, all the C code um, and explain basically the different options. And so right now we're using mode input, which is because we want to be able to read the pins. And then we're using GPIO pull up. Um, which means that those pins are getting pulled up to 3.3 volts, I believe. I didn't actually measure it, but that's what I understand. Um, let me go this way so the light's not quite so bright. Uh, but there's also GPIO pull down, which would make the pin by default go to ground, and then you would connect it to 3.3, which is this uh, pin 9 here that says 3.3. So you connect 9 to 4 if you switched it to pull down. And there's also GPIO pull none, Pull no, sorry, pull no. Um, and in that case, you would connect a resistor between 3.3 three and the pin, and then the pin to, to, to ground, um, and just make those kind of biggish resistors, like 10K or something, and then you could pull one of them down with a 1K or wire. So anyway, um, hopefully that helps. If you have other ideas of demos you want to see or tutorials you want me to create, let me know. Um, thanks a lot.